Hello, I'm Laura McCarry at The Hidden Edge with another tea break tip on how to use business models and tools to help you manage your growing business. Today, we're looking at quality circles and how they can help you with continuous quality improvement. Quality circles is another Japanese model involving employees forming teams to identify and solve process problems in their areas of work. Because most departments don't work alone, the principles of quality, um, quality circles has evolved into something called KSM. First, let's have a look at what a quality circle is and how it works. One approach to implementing total quality management is to use quality circles. A quality circle is a group of six to 12 volunteers who meet regularly to discuss and solve quality issues in the work environment. Circle members are required to collect data and take surveys. Companies need to train team members in team building, problem solving and statistical analysis. The reason for using quality circles is to push decision making to an organisational level where those who are doing the job and know it better than anyone else are making the recommendations. It is a great empowerment opportunity and a high motivator for those who volunteer. The quality circle process begins with a selected problem and ends with a proposed solution presented to senior management, costed for return on investment. Firstly, the organisation needs to buy into the quality circle process. Training needs to be given, as previously discussed. Problems need to be identified. Data needs to be uh, gathered and then solutions resolved from that prior to the presentation for the senior management. Quality Circles has limitations in that most serious quality problems arise in processes and, and activities that involve more than one department or function. Quality Circles has since evolved into KSM or continuous improvement which removes the drawback of quality circles by utilising multifunctional worker and production engineering teams to improve quality and productivity. Keizen is derived from the Japanese, K meaning change and Zen meaning good. Combined continual improvement or continuous improvement. It is based on the three M's, Murray, that is overburden or insufficient resources. That could mean clutter, poor training, poor tools, or poor instructions. Mura, which is inconsistency of supply and or demand. And Muda, wastefulness, any step in your delivery process that is not value adding. I love this tool as it focuses on the key questions that need to be considered for any quality circles. It is based around the who, what, where, when, why and how questions. Whilst each may seem a little over intensive, the template ensures that no stone is left unturned. I won't go through each of these questions as you can download the template and consider them for yourself and any quality concerns that you may have in terms of your business that you need to consider. So there you have an insight into quality circles and Kazen, continuous quality improvement. Have a go. Download the templates from the Hidden Edge website and whilst you're there, do share your stories of how quality improvement circles or quality circles and particularly Kazen has helped you in your business or indeed uh, in a business that you've pre previously worked in. That's it from me. Until next tea break time, enjoy the rest of this one.